All right, hello and welcome to round number three. Currently 2-0 in this legacy event. Sure, I'm gonna keep this hand. Would love to find one more land. But I think this is doable. Opponent also keeps seven. Found out DNT is again quite nice deck on Legacy. Kind of dropped down for a moment when campaigns were coming. Yeah, for sure, for sure. All right, playing against the combo deck of sorts. But wait, there's more. Damn it. Can I can I force this? I can't force this. So they're gonna draw get to draw two cards. But yeah, there's like Echo Fail, so. That's so good though. I guess I have to let this go. That was such an insane draw from them. All right, can I find a plow for this? Easy. I'm just gonna plot this main face. Can I find a couple of hundred dollars? <laughs> if you believe hard enough, I think this is fine because we can just deferry bounce it. Actually, I like that. <laughs> That's sweet, said my canon art. Yeah, it's it's kind of dope. We'll look hot in our frame. Yeah, it, it's really pretty. Yeah, this is fine. Oh, I shouldn't. Whoops. I think I'm going to just brainstorm end step so it goes to the graveyard and I can cast my Udo. So now we have a clock. Still holding up fours. We have a hand full of uncastables. This is great. Yeah, they have they kinda have this turn to slam Orsa. So. 
Yeah, yeah, I'm playing on Bouncing Chalice. But I think that putting the 6 6 into play is going to be more important right now. And if they want a YOLO redraw 7, then we can just force them. When they don't have an Arsene in play, this matchup seems okay. Four mana, this is probably Ursa. Narset. No, this this one we have to force. Um, do we actually? Yeah, I think so. Echo Faeons, but we draw, so it's fine, kind of. Man, we, we did not draw very well, that one. Still drew an Oko. Okay, things are getting out of hand here. I guess that just happened. Yeah, that's... Uh, it looks like GG over there. Unless they don't go for Lattice. For whatever reason. Because they have exactly enough mana for that. Oh, did you see that? That is the lattice, all right. All right. Their hand was better than ours. All right. Um, Pyroblast sounds okay. Wilt sounds okay. Deafening silence. This can go. Narset is fine. Probably Labyrinth can go. Fluster. Ice Fangs are kind of medium. Yep. The great creator got us good. For all the echoes, yeah, but our opponent had too much, too many echoes, and we also had to force the Narset, right? If I if I had not forced the Narset when I did, our opponent would have been able to just they had two echoes in hand, so. I mean, I felt like I had to, right? Our, our... yeah, exactly, because the problem with with forcing is that we have nothing, right? And our opponent is gonna start drawing two cards a turn. And we will be go down to a single card. So I think we just couldn't not let that resolve. Um, also, I don't like um, cantrips against the Narset deck. Maybe we can cut. I'm thinking about Veil of Summer. I'm not sure whether I want the Veil or not. No, I, I do want the plows. I need answers to Embry. 
uh, late in the game. They can do some really nasty stuff on turn one, so I'm going to hold up rep here. Can Surgical be good here? No, I don't think so. Chalice on one. It's fine. I guess it's not so fine if they have a lot more things to do here. God damn it, they always find the echo. This is actually what I lost the finals, what I lost to in the finals of the of the previous one. So we actually have to rev here, which honestly kind of sucks. We're super naked. But if they have Ursa here, like we're super, yeah, this is so tough. Narsa, that's even worse, probably. Phew. All right, so do I want to shuffle any of this away? Might want to shuffle this one away. So, for speech and brainstorm. So there's an astrolabe on top. So I'm just gonna hang out here, Let's see what our opponent does, and act accordingly. Whoops. That's a Lyosan Diamond. You got it. God damn it. I just can't win. <laughs> Just can't freaking win. Oh, this is ridiculous. Red elemental blast. But I couldn't I couldn't counter this on the stack, because otherwise my opponent just echoes. Um Will I have the time to cast an astrolabe? I think I don't. <laughs> Trying to draw Oko here. Ugh. <sighs> It's rough. Echo of Aeons. Okay, so what happens here? So I guess I can top deck. 
um, Pyroblast or Fluster to Fairy. All right, whatever. Let's go. Okay, okay. This echo is actually okay for us. Damn it. All right, so if they have Karn, what happens? Now I have to force this, right? This is so ridiculous. Here we go again, spin the wheel. Uh, thank you for that follow PDB1. They, at least this time around, they don't have as much mana. Chalice on one. Um... So we can, yeah, we let this go now. Because we can Teferi, Bounce It, Echo. Yeah, so we Teferi, Bounce the Chalice, we Deafening Silence. And then we have access to Um, get that back up. All right, so now we should have double force with fluster, and Oko is lethal next turn. All right, so we were able to get there this time around. <sighs> Crazy. Chalice is good. Emery is... Also good, because we can force that to chomp. So I'm saving this for an Ursa, basically. They can't play a non-creature, but they can still play Ursa. And they don't have enough mana for a second Ursa. And they can't fight back, because they already played their Chalice. They also can't cast Echo. Ballista for one. I did not see that one coming. Okay, so. We are sh we're still fine, right? We just elk the lave, swing with everything. They block and ping, so they have to block with both. So they go down to one. That means that both ancient tomb are on. Both ancient tombs are off. And they have one card. Okay. Probably gonna get some info on the way out. Because I don't think they can win anymore. <sighs> Holy shit, this deck freaks me out. <sighs> All right. 
If I miss the Ballista and Elk? No, I don't win at them because uh, they just uh, ping my 1-1 one, one, and then they just they go down to 1 except now they can block the Snapcaster profitably. Oh no! No, you're right. Yeah, actually blinking, blinking the Ballista would have been better, right? No, because then I only have two attackers. So my opponent just kills the thing in response and we're still in the same, we're still in the same spot because I don't have an Astral Leave attacking, right? <laughs> was the last time you played against this also showcase challenge? Yeah, it was a showcase challenge, the previous one. I lost in the finals against this specific, this very deck. Uh, this hand doesn't do anything, so we have to ship it. This hand is better. Maybe I should have bought on the Astrolabe there, actually, because of Chalice. Should definitely lost the bottom of the Astral Leap. <sighs> okay, now we have double force. Holding on to the force of will because this one allows me to actually. Wow. Wow, the yellow load. Okay, we have a shot now. There is this chalice though. So is my top the top of my deck versus my opponent's top of their deck. Fluster probably not doing much. Wilt would be a great draw. Deferi would be a solid draw as well. Just need to draw something. Just something. Anything at all. <laughs> Sibalista. Chalice for two. Okay, I still have a bunch of three drops that I can draw. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Also, if I draw if I draw the fairy, we can bounce this chalice and they cannot play for one anymore. Come on, the fairy, Yoko, Udo, Misty Rainforest. Well at least now I can draw something like a force. Ponder is better when you think if it's, if it's like in combo decks, in value decks, like this program is better. Just gonna hard cast. Ballista for three. All right, we need something here. God damn it, man. Oh. So I guess most of my deck is dead right here. Okay, what what should I do with this Oko?
So if I occult the chalice, that means that the chalice is going to be attacking me as well. So that's going to be 3 plus 4, 5. Plus 5. So it's not lethal. I think I have to elk the chalice though. Because this allows me to potentially draw like a source of plowshares. It, it just opens up a lot more potential draws for me. Oh, actually, I have this draw for a source of plowshares. Okay, so we're just dead now. I forgot that I was going to fetch. Yeah, so I'm just dead. There's nothing I can do. <laughs> they just have lethal. They just suit up the ballista. All right. Yeah, if I had drawn the Yoko like one or two turns earlier, I think we would have won this game. Gross. Gross. No, they won't attack Oko because they have exactly lethal. But yeah, but just I had to elk into an answer to either one of these. If I elked into a plow, that was my only shot, right? Because at that point, like I can actually start kind of like playing a game again. That sucks. Yeah, that that deck still owes me apparently. <laughs> Owns me, sorry, is what I meant to say. Alright. Um Two and one, a little bit sad, but it's okay. We can we can just win all from here on, and we'll we'll be okay, right? All right, I will see you for round number four.